then I go up to knee and waist, my opening my chest and shoulder, then I go to rest. <coughs> Even the simple thing becoming a routine and all of a sudden adding so much. His philosophy, his way of saying, hey, because of, because of my, my recommendation, you added 10 more years into your life. Well, well I, I don't know what you want to live 10 more years in or not, but either way, you know, anyhow, you're gaining 10, 10 years. That's, you know, he puts that way. Very beneficial, so we can share with other, other people a lot more. Hey, this morning, I want to uh, begin with a simple uh, knife and exercise, knife and back stance, along with the grandmaster's <coughs> breathing. Okay? You know, I go this way, fingertip is <coughs> well focused, or all my body is relaxed, especially on my upper body. So when I inhale, hands, uh, hands prepare, when I do exhale, then all my energy go down to my low abdomen. So that you don't have any, uh, any tension develop your upper chest, or perhaps neck and face. When you are passionate, then all your energy going down to low abdomen. So we can truly accommodate some of his teaching method into our daily practice, what you are already accustomed. It's okay. It's okay. Stand, stop, guys. Okay. Everyone, take two steps back, please. Tension trip. Remember to distance, distance here. Let's repeat. One. Perhaps you have a ball here between, between my fist and my elbow. Two. And three. All the way down. And at that time, shoulder relaxed, the face relaxed. All your energy is on your low abdomen and your fist. Just think about that. When I look at your body, you are very well dignified. When I look at your chest, it's so calm and relaxed. When I look at your far distance, man, you have a perfect balance. You look so strong that I cannot even touch you. And at that kind of a jump distance, I won't think that you are at that position right now. So meaning fist is very well made and your low abdomen is really, really focused. And I get a baseball bat right here hitting your low abdomen and you are firm. Rock solid. And doing all the moves for the next few minutes and I want you to think. And I'm going to do knife and blocking. Remember, we do knife and blocking this way. This is low block together. In the past. Remember, two knife and, huh? two knife and block that way. But now, we're putting our hands together. So I do low block. So when I do that, one knife and low block. This is a relaxed position here, inhale. Then this is exhale position here. At that time, my low abdomen is tight and my fingertip is tight, otherwise whole body relaxed. This is a relaxed position here, preparation, that's nice speed. So, see, the longer you do, sometimes you do longer and longer, then you are in fatigue. But if we can accommodate the grandmasters like a breathing method, when we do simple <laughs> basics like that, and I think that's truly, truly warming up. Let's do uh, one knife and over We're going to take like three steps forward and turn around three steps like that. So space management, we can do it. Everyone take just one step back. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So from the stands. stance. Okay. 
One. I want you to relax, all body relax, fingertip focused. Inhale. Return back. Then I'm going to mirror right here. My hands indicating. When you are swimming, the hands are going, that will go. Depending on where you are pointing, right? Then I'm going that way. Watch my right hand. My, my right hand is a guiding hand. My right hand finger is that way. Not that way because I'm going like, see? No, yes. And this is a relaxing position right here. So this is important. My right hand is guiding that. So I'm going that way now. So my right hand has to be there. Hmm? I count. Ready? One. Relax there. Relax. Lower your body. Go put the hand together. Open hand. There you go. Lower the body. At that time, I want to see your shoulders really relax. Okay. That is under. Okay. All right. All the way. Deep. Okay. Relax your shoulder. It's not tense. Like I told you this morning, when you do grandmaster exercise, if you know how to do properly, then you are fine, otherwise your body is aching. Squeeze dip. Okay, that looks fine. We turn back, go back in bed. Send my key down here. Okay, good. Ready? One. Not enough, go all the way dip. Like this. Some of you are doing that way, go all the way. Okay, there you go. Two! Yeah. Oh, yeah. And it's a back stance. So more than 70% of your body weight into your back leg. Next one, from there. Opposite, one. This time, this time, your left ten fingers pointing at me right here. All right, guiding. Okay. Relax your shoulder. Please relax your shoulder right there. There you go. Ready? Go. Now we're going to repeat this like that, okay? It's one knife hand. Put your hands all the way back. One knife hand. There you go. Fine. Good. Ready? Hey, hello. Look straight. Ready? One. I want to see right hand, right hand is pointing at that flag right here. Right hand palm down, palm down, good. Reason why I put my palm down, because you're going <coughs> to two third distance and right here and flip. Generating, you're going to sharper. Ready, go! Good job, stay right there. Even turning, same thing. First, when I hit the drum, only turning your head, that's all I want. Thank you, we turn back. Make sure you check the direction you're going by looking. All right, turn back. So when you are turning, I want you to make a habit that you're going to be turning your head first. Here, I'm going to be turning now. Feet together, hand together. My left hand is pointing at the window now. There you go. Then, then I do low block. Okay, good. One, two. Okay, one, put your hand together and facing that way. Turning your head, try to separate them, okay? Ready? One. Put your feet together and hand together, good. Your left hands pointing at the window. Ready? Go, Eileen! Thank you. Let's do one count. One count, one motion. Hands on the other side. Hands on the Relax your shoulder. When I see that, see? Otherwise, you will be aching. I want you to feel good. People, we've been doing this a long time, so we know this. We know this exercise. I don't want this becomes your uh, labor in your body. This is tight. Okay, one count, one motion, stepping forward. Hands on that, aremaki. Remember, preparation, inhale, and exhale. Low abdomen. 
تقدم التايمر ريدي جو شاف دي جو وي غون تو ميك ا فيري جود تيك اوف ذا ذا باك ستانس اي لايك يور فينجر تيب ذاتس جود لوكس فيري ويل فوكسد وين اي سي يور شولدرز سو ريلاكسد وين اي لوك ات يور فيس يو يو سو بيسفول ريدي جو
here. Okay, one night friend, outside of the lot, my count, one and two from here, ready? One, left hand's under. The right hand, the right hand fingertips are painting, uh, pointing at the front, uh, front section here, good. Lower the body a little bit, lower, lower, there you go, lower. Here, ready, go! Put your right hands all the way back, there you go, left hand's out. And your hip position, I want to see your hip. Instead of standing this way, instead of standing this way right here, go down more like this, sitting, sitting on something. Ready? Your eyes at your fingertips. Everyone freeze, freeze. It's like a statue here, right? They're good. You know what you stand by hand? This is called stand by hand, so loose. Look at this. No. Hey, keep it all the way back. Ready? One. One, 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 one. You're facing this way. Good. I know you already know this one, but I'm only reviewing there. Stay there, please. Relax. Ready? Two. Listen to your body right now. This is all relaxed. Oh, relax. I want to see. This is tight. Your hands tight. I mean, hands focused. And lower abdomen tight. Otherwise, relax. Go down more. Okay, sir. What about your standby hand? Your hands too loose right now. Hand has to be strong, focused. Your hand has to be strong. Fist is very well made. All right, do it again. Ready? One. One. Only one. One. Ready, go! <laughs> Eyes at your fingertips. Now we're going to be turning from there. From turning. This is one. This is two. Ready, one! Okay, like this here. One knife and outside the block, two knife and outside the block, same. This is one knife and I have two knife and.
Kijk, van mij van huis uit je blad. Mijn kant, wat is Open right now, here. Oh, hey, yes. Hey, this is the last one. Be patient. We're almost to that. Good. Freeze, freeze right there. Good job. Good focus. Good arm more. Sit a little more. Yes, yeah, thank you. Go. One and two. One. My right hands are coming under. My right hands are coming under. No, under. Ready, go! Hey. During the instructor's camp, and I want to make sure we are all uniformed. Otherwise, sir, Mr. Smith told me this way. How come you're teaching me this way? Because he told me hands coming around your neck. Now you tell me hands around, around my elbow. You're going to hear all kinds of things. So this is a good time. We are all uniformed. Mucham. And go. One and two turning. One. Basic punching time, okay? Punching, you punch where you are. Just remember. Here, punching where you are is unnecessary because I see that it is unnecessary for you to pull back. It's unnecessary though, okay? When you are doing it, just right there. Same thing. Take sajan, take paltan. It is unnecessary for you to pull back and punch. It may kill the rhythm when you do pungsa. So that's the only thing I see, except the turning her head each time when she's changing direction. Master, do stand up, sir. Turn around. Me! Ten steps, number two. Ready? So now head is turning good, sharp before he's changing direction. Four, five, six. And I want to see how he's punching right there. We've been doing 
doing 10 steps number two, long time. We do this basics here, just a little touch up, I think we're gonna be very fine. Just remember to do blocking, remember to turn, the, turn your head, and the last one, punching portion from there, you are punching that way instead of pulling it back. You got that, right? Sure. Otherwise, sure. I think you're going to be fine. Let's practice 10 steps number to stand up, please. Sure. 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 <laughs> See, right now, problem is, look like you do 10 steps number two. We have like at least about three, four versions. Okay, turn it up. Chumbi. A uh, couple things to remember. I am going to turn my head each time I am changing my direction. When I'm punching, I'm going to punch it where I am instead of pulling it back. Okay, 10 steps number two. I'm going to repeat more than three times, so take your time. <coughs> One. 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 Yeah, when you do 10 steps number two, make it a habit of counting. and right, you only need the low block. There's no outside, but put your hand down. Knife and low block, good. Now, when you do front and back, you do hands, go to, you know, middle and then outside. <laughs> now your low block is down, there you go. Six. Punch where you are, yelling. Yes. Go, do that one more time, go back, go back. And you're gonna look straight right there, punch him right there. Eyes, everything, focusing with it. Go! Yeah. Then you want to make a super, super, very sharp stance. Front is bending, back leg is straight. One more time, go back, please go. Remember, when you are yelling, my energy goes down to lower abdomen here, okay? Not your chest. Ready? Go! Yeah. And put hands all the way back. Sharp, okay. Turn around. Ready? Go! Now I'm counting. One knife in, one knife in. Yeah. Remember, punch where you are. Yeah. When I say baro, make sure you're turning your head to turn back. Say baro, baro. That was good. Let's keep doing it. I know we can be sharper. Hey, this thing. The, the more you repeat, the better you're going to be. Sometimes you are here. I know that that's good because I already memorized a long time ago. Okay, you're doing fine. You actually do it instead of thinking that you know. To be. Ten steps number two, same pattern as repeat. One. Low block, low block, low block. Let's look at the one in uh, the five point. If you need knee problem, sit comfortably. Yellow belt. Stand up. What's your name? Charlene. Charlene. What's the main what's the main reason why we do like the basics? Back stands, back and forth. Why we do that? Have a sit, please. That's one answer. Main thing, yes. So foundation. Foundation, yes, that can be good too. Main reason why we do basic is that to learn how to relocate center of gravity from one position to another. We're talking about the center of gravity here. Center of gravity is right here, that really moving. It's so important. Instead of the head is turning, this is not moving. It's a problem, right? 
I want to go there, but this is not going. Center of gravity is not moving. And sometimes, large turn, even though you turn, it takes time. It is simple to go this way, but turning time, uh, see, moving and losing balance. So you gotta have a good understanding, good repetition for center of gravity matter. So focus on the waist. Master Vincent, stand up, please. Sir. That's me. Facing the audience, please. Sir. Ten steps, number two. Ready? One. One. Now I'm pulling this. He's doing number two. Do number two like the typical, you know, yellow belt. Ready? Go. Two. Like that. Two. You turn back. And I want to go back. Put a number one. Okay. Now, enhance that. I'm just, I'm just guiding a little more with the gravity. Two. Two. Turn around, do like the yellow belt turning with three. Like that. Three. Remember, gravity. You don't want to drag it, but turn back. So you as an instructor giving him a little more touch. Three. Three. You got that? So every time you are changing, that has to be done. It is, I'm giving you a very, very good tip for you to be sharp right here. Once again, center gravity reason. You don't want to drag it. Just like the hand is a keep moving, but this is the, this, this does not want to follow. And I want to turn my body, but because the big chunk of muscle is delaying me. Just focus this. You're gonna keep the same though. Turn back. Sure. So we're gonna we're gonna work on that. See, when you do ten steps, number two, right here, basically one, two, and turning three. Now I keep the balance of moving this. Let's practice that. Adding one more, one more tip into the. Uh, the typical pattern we've been training. Stand up, please. Sure, sure. Sure. Did it? Okay, all right. To me. Well, quite a few things you're turning your head, punch where you are. Other than what grandmaster's teaching, breathing exercise, so that this is really relaxed. Then gravity. Counting. One! Oh, luck. Remember gravity. Your instructor, your dear master is pulling your belt right now. Remember, they, he, your dear instructor is pulling your belt ready. Go. You're going to be not only you're turning your head, remember, remember, it's a large chunk of your muscles is turning. Gravity. Ready? I'm pulling your back. Ready? Go. There you go. Now your pump says light. Oh. Even this one, you are changing direction. I'm pulling your belt to my left. Of course, you have to look. Oh. All right. Same thing. Go. Six. You're gonna punch where you are. Straight. Very sharp stance. Let's go. Six. Again, look back. Turning. Quick. You never want to drag when you are changing directions. That's, that that will destroy all the uh, uh, the valuable thing. And you want to punch the up. Go! Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Some of you are already losing that punch away you are please. Ready? Go. 